Show up and follow up. It's so easy. The basics of success in this industry, show up and follow up. Use your voice as early as you can in your career, in all of its authenticity, in all of its freak flagness. Um, you know, it's the first time you introduce yourself into the room and ask that peculiar question that makes you memorable. Always be curious, ask questions, and never be afraid to ask more questions. Networking is really, really important, crucial to your career, to your life. Um, it's the best way to make friends within the industry, grow your career. You never know when your next position is coming from. But sometimes connecting with people is not about just work and how smart you are, but just connecting to them about things that they like and enjoy and the world and the world that we live in. When you think it's time to leave, stay longer. All of those wounds that felt personal, like you know that first jab at your thinking or those concepts, are actually going to be the most formative things of your career. Um, not only will you learn to thicken uh, your ability to kind of shield your thoughts and keep your uh, commitment to your own point of view over time, but that stuff is like the stuff you grow from. See, see the full movie that you envision and then go back and unpack the end movie of how you want it to be, but see the whole movie first of what you want to create, and then work backwards to make your movie happen. If you do it the opposite way, the movie never comes out right. What we do in this industry, we're the most like gifted people on the planet. So always remember that when times are tough, when it's not going your way, or you have a difficult client, just remember you're really blessed to be able to do what we do. You're not gonna enjoy every single piece of work that you do. I think the best thing is to find people that you enjoy working with. Work is really important but it's not everything in your life. I have put work first many times but um, I think it's just always important to continue you know staying true to yourself, spending time with your family and just uh, figuring out ways to balance it all. So when something fails it doesn't mean you failed, it means there's a lesson to be learned and there's something to be taken away from that. Uh, later on in life Right? I learned that it's really important to take care of my heart um, first before my mind. And my heart finds happiness in spending time with those that I love, doing things that I enjoy, uh, being in the moment, right? Putting your phone down. I know it sounds cliche. I take my photos for Instagram and then I put the phone away. Carve out time of the day for self-preservation, self-help, or whatever you need to do to be yourself. For me, it's about always moving. So that means whether it's using the Peloton, or taking long walks around Brooklyn, or if I'm abroad, just like finding those strange corridors to go down. I think it's important for me, it's that sense of movement, not being idle, that has always been a healing process for me. Take your time, disconnect, put your phone down, um, and make sure you get outside in nature. I'm never forgetting to laugh, uh, never forgetting to, to keep your sense of humor, keep your personality. If you're not yourself, with your own sense of humor, you're not probably in the right job. Don't tell me I have to do it again, okay? <laughs>